Oi. What's in the bag? Here you go. Ah, oh, this one. Ah, oh, this is me up Creek bag. Yeah. Alright, give us a gander. You wanna have a... Ah, oh, yeah, no, definitely. You can have a look at it. Um, so, yeah, no, this is basically... You know how you wouldn't go to work without your tools? Yeah. This is um basically my little toolbox for when I'm lost my mind kind of thing. And I'm feeling a bit worthless and don't want to be here anymore. This bad boy here, it's... um. So mindfulness, and just about grounding yourself a little bit. So a lot of times why we feel so shit is for me anyway, because of the conversations that I'm having with myself when no one else is listening. So often I'm an absolute trash talker to no one else but myself. Sometimes I've recorded myself saying positive things about myself. And one example was I create my own reality. It's just trying to rewrite those conversations that you're having and trying to take them away from I'm a piece of shit to, you know, I'm all right. Another thing with that is it's breathing exercises like box breathing. They do it in the military. It's, um, you know, you can count for five seconds. So breathe in for five seconds, hold it for five seconds, breathe out for five seconds, hold it, breathe in, hold it, breathe out, hold it. So yeah, it's just kind of taking your thoughts away from that silly, silly rot that's going up inside your head. Because none of it's really based in reality. And then we've got this one, processing emotions. And in this bad boy, open it up. We've got listen to music, just let it out, jam it out, scream, cry, yell, crank it up as loud as you can. Cars are always really good for that. This one, I write a lot of shit down. If I want to say something and I can't quite say it, or I want to say something to myself, I want to say something to somebody else, write it down, get poetic with it, bloody get dramatic. It's a good time. No one else has to read it. It's just for you. Screaming, just going somewhere. Scream, scream as loud as you want. Crying. I'm very good at this one. I'm professional, in fact, I would say. Um, cry. If you need to cry, just do it. Fucking, what's going to happen? This one was important and I can't remember what it was. Ah, shake it off. You ever seen a dog that's stressed out? They shake it off. It can, um, or dance. Dancing, shaking, fucking. Some kind of physical outlet can also be really good. So it's important to actually process your emotions, feel them instead of just sitting on them. Massive, 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 massive. Even those ugly ones. Because you can ignore them and you can un not quite understand them for as long as you want, but they're gonna come back to bite you. <laughs> so if you actually confront them a little bit and a really good way to do that is music, writing it down and physical outlets, so um, yeah. So. That's me. A little bit of a tour of my tour bag. That's not all of it, and I'm still learning new ones every day. Ah, oh, hold on, there's one more. This one. So this is talking to people. So sharing, sharing your pain. It helps as well too. And there's all these services, and um, friends and family if you have them, fucking strangers. Yeah, cheers. Have a good one. Get right over. Sit on my ass. See you later.